Hello everyone, this is MJ Hobby Corner, and this is another MJ Hobby Corner game, and we have today the Julie the Merciless, <laughs> right there, and Julie the Merciless uh, against me, and we are going to play a duel of Weasel Tech, and this is a new uh, mech war game by uh, Nordic Weasel Games, okay, and I already played this game alone, I'm just teaching Julie, and uh, we're going to play the uh, player on player, which is very different from the solo play and the campaign stuff that you do. Uh, where this game shines is really in the campaign and story mode, okay? And uh, it's very similar to Five Parsecs from Home in some respects. All right. So uh, this is the board we will be fighting on. And uh, why don't we quickly introduce the max and then... Uh, get on with this uh, game. So Julie and I are just going to kill each other. I think that's the easiest kind of thing to do. And Julie's mechs and, and her troops are deployed on that corner of the table. Okay. And she has that nifty little uh, plane hybrid mech. Okay. We'll see how she uses that. And then we have this nice river here in the middle of the table. And then uh, here are my forces. They're deployed on the opposite corner of the board. All right. So basically we have a bridge there and basically we're just going to try to annihilate each other and we'll see by turn five what happens. Mm -hmm. All right. Julie, any last minute things? Uh, no, not yet. Not yet. All right. Well, let's get on with this game. All right, so this is turn one over, and we have on Julie's side, her centurion uh, moved forward. He fired his beam and hit my adder. Okay, my adder has two points of armor left. And then her airplane hybrid moved over here. I don't know what she's planning. And her infantry is in between the forests. And here I moved my python mech. Uh, and I think I will have line of sight this turn. We'll see. And this is my armored car and my troops near the bridge. So let's go on to turn two. All right. So Julie's giant centurion here, that very tall individual, uh, moved six inches, five inches or six inches? Six, six inches, right? He's mm -hmm. a big guy. And he moved right over... Uh, Right near the forest there, but he's not blocked, and he has clear line of sight to my python, which is right here. And my python has not been hit. Yikes. Yet. Yet. So, <laughs> Julie, you have what weapon you're going to use? The beam. The beam, which is endless in this mm -hmm. game. Okay. Yikes. And no minus one because you've cleared the forest. So why don't you go ahead and shoot that beam? Um, but what number am I looking for? Oh, right. Uh, hold on a minute because I got to get you a screen rating. All right, so my screen rating is three. So Julie rolls her beam. She has a plus one targeting. She gets a six. Um, and so uh, it has to be over the screen rating. Not equal to, but over mm -hmm. the screen rating. I have a three, so she does hit me. And, uh, well, that's it. Um, uh I take one armor damage all right so python has armor three he now has armor two because the beam has weakened it mm -hmm. whatever beam was invented during world war ii i don't mm -hmm. know <laughs> all right so python takes a hit Ow. all right and there he is a nice little 
flame on Python as he is hit. Don't worry, I'll get you. I'll get you, Centurion. I'll get you, my dear. <laughs> All right. <laughs> my Python is going to turn around and say, what? No. Uh, he's going to... He's yeah. Remember, we have a non-combat action, which we can activate any equipment we have. Mm -hmm. um, so I don't really have an equipment yet that I want to activate. So I'm going to move him. And he's going to move six inches. Now, he could move into the river. The river's not impassable to walkers like them. Is it rough ground? Yeah, it is okay. considered rough ground. Mm -hmm. So, he is going to lose some movement. Now, do I really want to move him into the river? He's got to get out of there, though. Alright, so he's going to go down. He's going to go down. And... On the river, splash into the water as he is smoking, and uh, he's gonna fire that gun on Centurion. Mm. So, what kind of gun does he have? What kind of weapons? Okay, he has rockets and he has a machine gun. So, I'm gonna fire some rockets at you, and Wonderful. yeah. Okay. All right. All right, so firing my salvo of rockets, and a python is carrying RPG 5s. They have attack 5, so 5 dice, and they have a spread of 4 inches. And so I'm going to target both her centurion and the troops next to him. And the white dice are going to be the troops, and three of them are going to go for her centurion. However... Julie, what is the intercept roll of your Centurion? 2d6. So okay. that means two dice. Right. So grab your two dice, and you got to roll fours to see how many rockets he gets to shoot down. Four or above. Yep, that's your intercept. One. Okay, so you shoot one rocket down. So one of my black dice is going to be okay. out. Now for your troops. Uh, what Do your troops have any intercept? I believe they do. Two. So they get two dice and see Four. see if they can shoot down the oh one. one more. So I lose one more rocket. So that means that I only get uh, uh -huh. these dice left over. So these are gonna roll to hit, and I roll fours. Ooh, two hit. Two hits. One on the infantry, okay. and one on the centurion. So one man just blows up. And then the Centurion it takes an armor you. damage. Yeah, bigger. All right, moving on. Infantry, does the infantry have to go after? You're right. Yeah, we did that wrong. Sorry, guys. Yeah, we were supposed to move. Well, no, we were right. You moved Centurion. You moved one, I moved one, and then you should have moved Infantry. Right, you're right. We did goof that. Okay, mm -hmm. so we'll just move Infantry now. Okay. They can shoot or they can move into the forest and get protection from the forest. But that's up to you, you know. Yeah, why do that? All right. Let's just... Let's shoot them all. If you're going to do it, do it, right? <laughs> <laughs> all right. Um, all right, so five attack dice. Mm -hmm. Why would I choose less? Because you want to... That would give less chance that you roll ones. Oh. So less chance that you're going to jam. Right. Because that means next turn you're going to have to lose an action. All right. Well, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to use five. Five dice. They're going to just slam their machine guns. There we go. Mm-hmm. Did you want to... You're not going to film it? It is filming. Oh, it is filming. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, yikes. So you hit on um, fours because it's within 10 inches. Uh, yeah. Four hits. My first hit. If... Roll. I rolled a one. I have a weapons malfunction. Select a weapon randomly, and that weapon is unusable until repaired. I have to do a repair action. Okay. The next turn. So, oh man. So I guess I'll choose my machine gun. Um, because I like my rockets. So I'll choose my machine gun and they'll be malfunctioned. So now I got another hit from you. That's the second hit. 
And this is going to be system damage. Yikes. So that's the first one is system malfunction. Mm -hmm. The second one, because you did mm -hmm. four hits, that's going to be system damage. And I rolled a three. Computer damage. Uh, all hit rolls are at a minus one penalty. Okay. Ah, uh, and that I can't change. Because that's oh, a system. That. Okay. No, that's a system damage. Now, if you had done a third hit, I go to the cripple table. Oh. And the cripple, basically, you know, it's you're pretty, pretty much cool, destroyed. Though. I like how that Yeah, it, it's fun. a very interesting. It is very different. So, my python took four hits, all right, from that infantry. And uh, the armor is now kaput. It took system damage and it took system malfunction. So he's not, not doing very well. No, he's not. So next turn, I'll have to try and repair my machine gun. And, uh, but no matter what, I'm going to have minus one rolls because of the uh, system damage. All right, moving on then. It's my turn. My infantry moves. That was a good hit, Julie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> See, even infantry yeah. can do damage. All right. Um, tinches. I'm going to move them through the bridge, if I can. Okay. And I don't, I really, ha I have a, um, a shot at your hybrid there, mm -hmm. your aircraft hybrid. So I think I'm going to shoot, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to do my machine guns, my stormtroopers. And ooh. ooh, look at that! You got two of them, or three of them. Three. All right, so go ahead now. So now first, the first one is a four. All right, and so this is the first hit. So you have you cannot use any equipment until repaired. Okay. You have an equipment that reloads your rockets, gives you an extra shot of rockets. Oh, okay. You cannot use that until it's repaired. Okay. Balance damage. The mech moves at half speed mm -hmm. and cannot dodge. Okay. So we'll have to mark that somehow. And that's the whole time now? Yes. Okay. You can repair the first one. The first one, but not the you second You can't repair the second yeah, that's what I So now it is your turn, and you decided to make a repair action mm -hmm. this turn, right? So it's a non-combat action, mm -hmm. and that's on your aircraft hybrid. Mm -hmm. Okay, so roll your four or over. You rolled a six, so it's fine. Okay, and uh, so you do repair that, so you don't have that problem anymore. Okay. And now, now uh, movement and sh no movement. No movement. You decided not to move, and you're right. gonna shoot. I'm gonna shoot my okay. um, rocket machine gun, I guess. You do machine gun. Yeah. Okay. So then I'm okay. It's five dice. Five dice. That is correct. And. It has a spread of four inches, four. and it hits on fours because it's within ten. Okay. Correct. Ooh, bad. Oh, that's terrible. I only oh. one hit. <laughs> All right, so one hit. So the bridge protected me. One guy goes out. Ah. And there's a rock <laughs> in his place. <laughs> He's dead. All right, so one little dude is out of the... the uh, the thing there, that's the thing about infantry, they're squishy. squishy. Alright, so uh, I think it's time to move my armored car. Right, so moving my armored car, um, I'm going to keep him behind the troops, so he's going to move, he moves six inches, he's going to move four, turn around, and then move two inches into the bridge and the bridge can be shot at <laughs> it does have armor so um okay. so my guys are now crossing the bridge i shouldn't have given julie that idea <laughs> and that pretty much ends my turn so okay, it's so now, now you my chimera i think that's your only unit right to end this turn left, yep. yeah okay so six inches mm-hmm Yep, take your time. Max or other vehicles. Right, so you're using the howitzer on your half track. And Air it's wars. going to fire on the infantry that's on the bridge. Yikes. 
One hit. Jeepers creepers. So the explosion hits, but the bridge is protecting me. I, but one more guy dies. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, yeah, oh, good. man. All right. So that was. I'm, I'm done. All right, and that's the end of that. So turn two is over. It Let's... is? You don't have another one? I don't have another one. Oh, no, no. that's right. You went first. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Turn three now. Let's see. Destroy each other. All right, so turn three, and I think I want to move my uh, adder. And the adder moves five inches. I don't have any non-combat action to do, so I'm just going to move him out of the rubble. Whoop. And his fire went out. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> All right, and he moves forward, and now... Um, that centurion is in my sights because he's so tall. That big dude over there. So I think I'm going to fire at him. And uh, he hasn't fired rockets yet. Oh, yes, he has. So he only has um, two rockets left to fire. Three rockets, I'm sorry. Three rockets left to fire. He had four. Mm -hmm. I think he's going to do... Yeah, he's going to do rockets. So he's going to fire a salvo of rockets at that centurion all the way over there. Okay? So five dice... You get your intercept rolls before I shoot. So, uh, however many intercept. I think you said it was two. Two dice. Oh, one down. So, I only roll four dice. Okay. okay. So, I roll fours now. Two hits. All right. Two more hits. Does he have any armor? He doesn't. So, now he has no armor. Okay. Okay. Um, the pencil. He no longer has any armor left. All right. Mm -hmm. So the next will be rolls on the tables. So, uh, all right. It's Julie's turn now. And my adder has now activated. I didn't want you to do that, but okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, uh, you're being silly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're being silly. <laughs> so she turns that big ass mech. Is he going to move? Just shoot, right? He's just going to shoot. Rockets. So he's going to shoot a bunch of rockets at the bridge. All right. Yes. It's going to hit the well, bridge. Well, but the rockets, I think the infantry would be able to at least try their intercept as the rockets come towards the bridge. Okay. All right. And that's it. I won't have the armored car do it because I think he's way back there. So we'll just do, they have two dice. Mm hmm so let me see if I can shoot any down out of the five. No, they failed anyway. So I hit on fours, right? Yep. Only two hits out of that. Though. Oh, so the bridge has two armor. Okay. Um, so I do have a chance. My sweater is taking out all these <laughs> things. <laughs> all right, all right. So that was a close call. We're gonna. She one? tried to shoot down the bridge. Yeah, I'm mad that I did, wasn't successful. All right. All so. Right. Here we go. Okay. Now it's my turn. Now I can move an infantry, and I think my infantry want to move out of there. All right. So infantry moves six inches. Ooh. So that's gonna be all the way over there. It looks like ah, All right, so uh, all the infantry <laughs> falls off. <laughs> <laughs> they can't walk right. They're a bit drunk. Too much partying. <laughs> They're like, wait up for us. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so setting up the infantry on the other side now. All right, so infantry sets up on this side. They move out of the bridge, and they have the hybrid on their sights. So infantry... Is gonna shoot, um, and I think I have, uh, I have grenades spread two inches. Um, firepower three, so that's attack three, and uh, they hit on fours. That's something that that's a house rule that I'm making up. Okay. So they're gonna lob grenades at that hybrid walker. 
let me just make sure yeah four inches away so it is three inches away so uh they're lobbing grenades at it and a four a four and a five so grenade explosions how much armor he has none he has no armor all right roll the first one mm -hmm. on system malfunction uh, all rolls are at minus one until repaired. All hit rolls are at minus one until repaired, but you do get to repair them. So go ahead. The mech cannot engage targets more than eight inches away. Okay. Not repairable. And this is a crippling one. That was a five. Equipment status is all functional. You don't have a problem with that. If you uh, roll a one, okay, if you roll a one, the mech suffers catastrophic damage, and that's explosion, basically. Okay. So just choose one weapon, knock it out, um, and then everything else is okay. You just got to roll one dice at the end of the I turn. I guess I'll knock out the rockets. Whatever you want. Yeah, that's what I'll do. So no rockets. All right, so he's lost his rockets, but he has his machine guns. All right, it's your turn. I did before, and shoot. Okay, yep. So infantry is targeting my python. On now. And I hit on fours, right? Yeah. Um, uh, three hits. Three hits. Now he has no armor. Okay. He has no armor, okay. so those three hits go straight. One hit goes to system malfunction. So go ahead. I get another system malfunction. Oh, you, that's right. Know? That's right. Um, so the Python gets a five. The mech moves at half speed and cannot dodge. Oh, until repaired. That can repair be repaired. So I'm at half speed. Next damage is system. Another six. The mech cannot engage targets more than eight inches away. I and have that one too. I have one catastrophic, one crippling effect. Yeah. All right. So I'm assuming they probably had bazookas and other weapons that they're firing at the mech, including their machine guns. So, all right. So he's bad. He's in bad shape. Just like my hybrid. All right. So I'm just going to take note of that and... That's it. All right, so my python is going to, he can only move half. Oh, man. So he's going to move up here. And then he's going to use his machine guns and fire on the infantry. Roll on fours. Oh my god. Uh, oh, four hits. That so, stinks. four guys die. Yeah, they did a lot of damage on that mech. So, four guys die. Alright, it is your turn. Um, I can go up, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can still launch. Yeah. I want to launch up and come down there on your infantry oh you're gonna launch up in the air mm -hmm. and come down on them all right so uh he has like an eight inch distance that he can do when he does that all right so we're just gonna put him wherever he can stand i will move him roughly um i can't really move him in any direction though so they're just gonna take damage Okay. Take two guys out. And then I can still shoot? Yeah. You All can right. still well, shoot. I will do that. So you're going to shoot on them? Yeah. Okay. On my guys. And hit on fours. fours. Oh, this is going to hurt. Oh, that's better. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right. Four dice. All right. So four dice damage. So four more guys. Two got crushed under the legs. 
and four more guys got gunned down. Yeah, one left. There's only one little dude left. <laughs> and he's going to roll to see if he runs away or not. <laughs> That's kind of the swarm rules. Okay. So he's going to roll to see if he bugs out or if he fights to the death. Two, three, last pilot decides not to join his comrades in death. And he goes away. Or four to six, the last pilot decides to uh, fight to the death. Ooh. He rolled a six, so he stays on the board. My little All infantry right. man is like, no way, I'm fighting to the death. Well, silly you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that was that. So he's activated, right? Mm -hmm. uh, to put a little gem on him. All, All right, right. And then the turn is done, and we go on to turn four. All right, so my armored car saw what happened with the infantry. And he was supposed to be guarding them. So he's going to move four inches. Or actually, five inches. And then he's going to fire right on your mm -hmm. dude there. All right, so he has a beam weapon. I think I'm going to do the beam. Okay, so it's one die. One die. Targeting plus one. So he has a plus one. Two. So he needs twos. He rolls a one. Plus one is two, but that doesn't make it because it has to be over the screen rating and not. Oh man, wow. that beam just fizzled away. You are damn lucky. I I know. I expected. Oh, to be now. I all right. Go ahead. Um. Okay. So I just have my vehicle left. He's gonna shoot. The tank. I mean, I shot the bridge before, right? Mm -hmm. I think maybe I'll shoot the bridge again, actually. With the howitzer? Yeah. All right. I hit on what? Is it still four? Mm hmm Okay. Two hits. Oh, shit. So both armor points on the bridge is weakened. It takes a hit. The bridge has no armor left. If it is hit again, then we roll to see if it is destroyed. Whatever's on it is pretty much destroyed with it. So, um, okay, so that was your half track. Mm -hmm. Yikes, they fired a, uh, a howitzer. Now, yeah, and you had line of sight. Okay. Yeah, and I don't have... Um, You're not moving him, right? No. No. I don't have the thing to look down, but now he's obviously... Uh, yeah, and that's it. That's the end of this turn. I moved yeah. all my guys. All right, so this is the end of turn three. Now moving on turn four. Turn three sees my python with no armor, very uh, injured. Okay, it has two uh, system damage and system malfunction. We see Julie's troops, a few casualties there. Mm -hmm. um, Julie's centurion has no armor. Julie's hybrid is really injured, but he mm -hmm. took out mostly all of my infantry. He <laughs> launched up in the air and landed on them, stepped on them, mm -hmm. stepped on a couple. My uh, armored car is still okay, and my adder uh, has only two armor left. Okay, so that's it for turn three. Moving on to turn four. Okay, turn four. Well, let's see. Turn four. We probably will not be playing six turns. We're only going to be doing five turns. Uh, things should get resolved pretty quickly here. Um, my python is there and he has no armor left. I um, think my python's going to turn. He's going to pivot. And um, next, he is going to fire on your centurion okay so python takes let's see what dice what what is he gonna use um python has an mg5 machine gun and also rockets he's gonna fire machine gun okay. so he's gonna take five dice and you're within 10 inches so that's force to hit he has no armor right no And a roll, a six, a four. All right, so that's uh, three, uh, two hits. Two hits. A six and a four, and the other are two threes and a two. So I got 
two hits. Alright, now what do I do? Well, now you have no armor, so you have to roll a 1d6 on systems malfunction and 1d6 on system damage. Alright, well... No, wait. Yes, yes. Here's the first one. First one. The four. He gets system malfunction. The mech cannot use any equipment until it is repaired. Okay. And then here's the next one. One. Weapon damage. A randomly selected weapon is unusable. Choose one weapon, knock it out, write it down, and that is it for him. The beam, I guess. Beam? Okay. Yeah, because the, the other one does more dice, right? The rockets. Yeah. So beam is out of commission. All right. And at the end of this turn, mm -hmm. you can roll to repair. And then you can repair your equipment. So oh. I think he has an ammo pod too, right? As an equipment. Because yeah. he can use that ammo pod. <coughs> okay. All right. Julie's turn. Okay. So I just want to make a correction. Um, no mech can take more than four hits. I think we've been rolling on the uh, systems malfunction and systems damage table over when a mech is hit. Once a mech gets... Uh, Four hits, it is catastrophic damage, which means the mech is destroyed and out of the picture. So that would mean that her Viper here, one more hit, he's gone. Uh, we're not supposed to roll over on the tables every time a mech gets hit. We were doing which that wrong. Sense. Yeah, which makes sense because then they never blow up. <laughs> so basically, you got first, second, and third hit. Uh, the third hit is a mech crippled, and that gets resolved at the end of the turn. You roll on that table. The fourth hit, if he gets hit four times, four hits go through, that's it. He's done. Okay? So, so anytime we do four hits, the mech explodes. Okay. That would have been, that's a lot quicker. That's well, yeah. that's the way it happens. Yeah, so I, sorry, we were doing that wrong. Oops. So, Centurion there is going to fire uh, some rockets. Ooh, watch the table. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> um, and let me do my intercept roll. Mm -hmm. How? What is that? My python? He has four intercept. Okay. So let's see how many rockets I can shoot down. So I have to roll fours. Uh, two. So two go down, two rockets. So just take two dice out of your attack. And that's it. You roll the rest. And all oh, three hit. God, you got to... Well, he had no armor. Right. He already had a systems malfunction. So he's done. He's then. done. He explodes. Oh, yeah. So. Because, yeah, it's way more than he originally had. Yeah. I think he had two hits on him, actually, already. Uh huh. He already rolled on the system damage. That's three hits, so he is gone. He explodes ah. in a ball of flame. <laughs> And oh, there is some flame there. Why am I so happy? It's my mech. No. <laughs> what is going on? All right. So that mech is destroyed. All right. Well, it looks like Viper might be my best target. I'm going <coughs> to give the action to my armored car. And uh, he's not even going to move from the bridge. He's going to fire his... That's the Mamba. Uh... He has five dice, his machine gun. It has a six inch spread. And so I'm going to put them all on him. He's going to fire. Machine gun, four plus. He's within ten inches. A six. Oh my god, they're all ones and threes. Only one hit. Well, that's all I needed. It gives him catastrophic damage because he already had like three hits on him. So catastrophic damage. So Bye-bye, my, my little so, hybrid plane. One for one, destroyed. All right. Yeah, I got one little infantry guy uh, left there. Uh, he's like, <laughs> well, He's fighting to the death, so. All right, your turn. This game's going to end soon, I think. Well, um, I only have... Well, the infantry, well, the infantry mm -hmm. is next, right? Yes, you're right. Yeah. Um. That's right. It's <coughs> one of your mechs, one of my mechs. 
What can I really do with my infantry, though? Nothing, right? Well, they can move and shoot. I mean, <coughs> oh, shoot. They what? have machine guns. Change. All right, well, that's what I'll do then. Oh, that's, uh, yeah, that's it. Okay. All right, so, all right, so they're going to move to the riverbank, mm -hmm. and they're going to shoot my adder. Now, my adder had no armor either. Right. So, so he's within 10 inches, so they, you need fours. And your machine guns, I think, have a four-inch spread. Okay. But there's nobody around right. him, so you can't. Okay. All right, so I need... All right, give me a second. All right, so you're going to make the attack roll mm -hmm. for the machine guns. Wow. Holy shit. That's way more than enough to destroy. Um, Five hits. Yeah. With the machine gun, the correction is uh, when attacking a single target with the machine gun, you get attack dice, attack rating minus one, which means a machine gun gets four dice instead of five, but you still did yeah. five hits. So that's four yeah, hits. Totally. It was still enough to blow that yes. mech up. <laughs> All right. Moving on as we are now dying. <laughs> and that was now my turn. Now it's your turn. So, uh, yeah, things are dying very, very quickly now that we're we're implementing the system correctly <laughs> the way we should. Uh, but it's okay. You live and learn. Uh, this yeah. game is designed for very quick action. So we could potentially have bigger armies. Yeah. You know. All right. So... Uh, the next one I think to go is going to be this guy. That's your Centurion. Yeah. Um, he's already rolling on critical damage at the end of this turn. Okay. Mm -hmm. So he gets hit once more and he's done. Okay. Uh, I've already lost both my heavy mechs. That would only leave one little infantry. Yeah, that's, when you go next, that's what you'll be doing. And then you're, and then I, yeah. I think you're going to be, I mean, you've destroyed more. And you won very by yeah. a very narrow margin, but let's do this. Let me see if I can destroy him. All right. With what? With my armored car. No. What? No, I don't. You moved. You, this was the first one you. Oh, moved. he doesn't go anymore. No, no, no. That's not what I'm saying. Your the infantry goes next. Oh, you're right. Yes. Yeah, it's the infantry phase. You're right. Yes. See, Julie keeps me on my toes. <laughs> So he's going to run, um, they move six inches, he's going to run his six inches, and he's going to lob grenades, <laughs> he's going to throw grenades at your mech, he is so small. That's hysterical, really, <laughs> you know, that's smart of him, what else can he do? That's yeah, hysterical. really, he's fighting to the death, yep. so, alright, so let me put him here. And there's my little guy approaching her mech. Um, so I'm going to fire. And grenades is only three dice. And you hit on what? Fours. Fours. Let's see what it does. Yeah. It's a four inch range. Oh, uh, two two hits. hits. So he's yeah. out of there. So he explodes. <gasps> oh. <laughs> Literally. Yeah. Oh so let's God. put his torso him, there. I? No, he comes oh. off. Oh, scare me. Should All right. So that's it for your mech. He's done. All right. And then now it's your turn and you have that half track I'm to do. That. So are you going to try to get revenge on my one little guy? Uh, I could do that. Well, I got an armored car too. That's what I was originally going to go for. But... Okay. Well, um, I the think bridge, yeah. bridge has two armor, by the way. Um, two I'm armor gonna armor. go after your car. Okay. Um. Where, yeah, you do have. Yeah. You might have to move your half track a little there for for line of sight. Oh, okay. Well, he gets that much move, so there you go. There. Six is. inches. All right. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay, so let All right, me, so uh, Julie fired her howitzer and it missed right here. Uh, explosion missed the uh, car she was going after, the armored car. And uh, then I realized the camera wasn't recording, so <laughs> it did not record our little ending bit. So we're going to end the game here because it's uh, beginning of the fifth turn. We're already 
pretty much wiped out. The only thing left would be her half track mm -hmm. and my uh, armored car, and then she had some infantry. Mm -hmm. So Julie wins this by a very narrow margin. Very narrow mar margin. Yeah. Uh, yeah, because I only have the armored car left. And next time we can have objectives, mm -hmm. and we can have uh, the game will go a lot quicker. We can have bigger armies because uh, <laughs> things die very quickly if you do yeah. it right. If we, yeah, exactly. <laughs> so what do you think, Julie, about Weasel Tech? I like it a lot. Yeah? Yeah, I do. I like it a lot. I'd like to get into more scenarios and whatnot with it. Right. Yeah. But, um, yeah, now that we are on the right track, so to speak. Yeah, yeah. Well, this was a learning game, so we're learning. Yeah. And uh, finally, we caught our mistake, uh, you know... Mechs only take four hits. Once right. they take four hits, they're done. Yeah, we were just we were constantly it. rolling on the first so two we were tables. Just prolonging it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but that's okay. At the end, we were like, oh man, everything's dying very quickly now. <laughs> All right, folks. So uh, um, please remember to vote. We have yes. our poll out for the next game. Yes, yes. Uh, Julie was not feeling 100% well, so hopefully she will uh, feel better soon. Let's hope so. Here's hoping. Yep, and uh, this way we can play the game that you vote on Yay. for this week. All right, folks, we'll talk very soon. Thank you very much, and uh, talk to you guys in the next video. Take care. Bye now.